Hey, this is Bill for Sparky Channel. Today I'd like to show you how to put new string on the new dual battery Milwaukee string trimmer. This is a bump head, and you notice the whole head is the bumping surface. So let's say you've run out of string, and you just got a little piece in here, maybe you just pull it out, you know. Uh, then you can check if you like. You can open this up and look in here, see if there's any debris, grass clippings, uh, more pieces of line, anything like that in here. If, if not, just close it back up. You see it's got a, a hole here and it's got tabs here. And so you take this and you put it on and just push it in. You're going to listen for a good click. You need a good click. Uh, there we go. That sounds good. There's, examine this and make sure this tab's all the way in and that this tab is all the way in. It's an important point because if these taps aren't all the way in the head, when you turn on your string trimmer, this head might just fly off, okay? So now what we're gonna do is we line up these red stripes right here. This red stripes on both sides. You come around this way and there's red stripes over here as well. And I have some Milwaukee string right here. This is a 0 .080 string. You can put up to 25 feet of point. 080 string in this string trimmer. It can also take 0 0.095 but you can only put 20 feet in the head and it can also take 0 0.105 and that will take 15 feet. So this is the the thinner of the three so you can actually put 25 feet in here and it says a line right here and you see that there's two red lines right there you align them and then it also says wind right here with an arrow clockwise and so what we're going to do is we're going to take the string and uh, get it as straight as you can and uh, you you put it in this hole right here okay and it's going to come out this other side right here so uh, a tip is to try and get this line as straight as you can because you're going to put it straight through if there's a curve you might not get it on the first try so just put it right through there and it came out there it came out the other side just like that now put both ends like this uh, match them up and we're going to pull this line all the way through all the way through like that so you got I got both lines matched up there and I just pulled it all the way through and now we're gonna wind it up okay and you go with the arrow the winding arrow Milwaukee says you're supposed to be able to do this within 30 seconds I don't know that might be stretching a little bit but it's quick it's easy Okay, so there's our line right there. I'll flip this over. Here's the cutting surface right here. So uh, put the piece of line right there and cut it and go back this way. There's the piece of line right there and cut it. Okay, that's just right. I'll put links in my video description for the Milwaukee 0 .080, 0 .095, and 0 .105 string trimmer line. And I'll put a link for the giant spool of the Milwaukee 0 .105 string trimmer line. Thanks. I hope this video was helpful.